10 things to do when you get wealthy. Welcome to Golden Lux. Yes, yes, we inspire future millionaires. Click the subscribe and hit the bell. Have you ever heard about those lucky ones that won in the lottery and lost it all after a couple of years? After losing all the money, they were left with the expenses of the shopping that they did when they had the money. Their life became even worse than before winning the lottery. Don't be that guy. Control your emotions. There are many stories of people from rags to riches, but what to do when you become one of them? Don't faint and don't be overwhelmed. We're here to show you 10 things that you should do when you get incredibly wealthy. Number one, shut up and be low key. Shh. There's no need to be loud about your millions. Getting rich may be super cool, yes, but don't let the other sheep know just yet. Before broadcasting it to the whole world, sit and think to yourself. If you tell the world, suddenly you will have sisters and brothers that you have never heard of. They have a famous name and it's a gold digger bitches. So be quiet and make smart decisions. Number two, don't make sudden changes to your lifestyle. Sure, of course you feel like you can suddenly switch from normal toilet to golden one, but remember to control yourself. You have all the time in the world to experience the rich life. That is, if you do the right thing. That instinct to splurge and spend cash to buy a palace and a Lamborghini will only get you broke again. Plan ahead and do the right thing. Number three, set your financial goals. Yes, you are so high. You can't contain the feeling of euphoria pumping out of your veins. But what now? What are you supposed to do with all that cash that you hidden under your bed? Find professionals that can advise you how to do more money how to make the money work for you. Don't buy things that will bring you only expenses in the future. Visualize your future. Think smart and think big. Number four, look for financial advisors. Before investing in something that you don't understand, you need to understand it. You need to be financial literate before making actions. Talk to your financial advisors and check your investment goals. A good financial advisor can help you to build a plan and sort out your priorities. Remember, the good one. There are plenty bums out there that pretend to be pros. So question everything and everyone. Ask a lot of questions. Keep your eyes and ears open. Don't be blind, don't be stupid. Don't be naive. Read this book by Tony Robbins, Money Master the Game, and you will know what to do. Number five, do not quit your job. I repeat, do not quit your job. You may feel like you no longer need to work your ass off, but stop. Even though you have a ton of cash ready to be spent, first, you need to figure out your future. Don't go shopping while eating gold. Be productive, grow your assets. If you don't have any, bitch, you're doing something wrong. Move that lazy ass. Get your assets now while still working. Number six, pay off all of your debts. Whew, what a huge relief. Finally, you will be able to pay every loan that you have. All those numbers that have been killing you inside and keeping you awake at night can finally get lost from your life. Among other things, this should be one of your priorities before you start your rich life. Pay all of your bad debt. Get yourself a good debt instead that will make you money in the future. Number seven, 
start an emergency fund. Your dog gets sick, you get sick, family member gets sick, you know, life. It may seem like everything is finally perfect. But, 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 stop yourself. Always be prepared. Always. You wouldn't want to get a fancy supercar and then after cry that you can't help a family member in case of an emergency. You have a chance to be a hero, save lives and do good in this world. Do that! Unexpected things happen and this is where your emergency fund becomes very handy. Benjamin Franklin said, by failing to prepare, you are preparing to fail. Number 8. Invest your money. Investing helps you to consistently grow your wealth without working your ass off. Seek help from your financial advisor on where to invest your money. Please do not, I repeat, do not listen to your friends because if they knew, they would be rich too. They want to see you do good but not better than them. Again, book by Tony Robbins, Money Master the Game. Then you will know how to invest in something that you understand. Number nine, help the world be a better place. Just like what Michael Jackson said, heal the world, make it a better place for you and for me and the entire human race there are just kidding but seriously why not help in making the world a better place to live in and frank once said no one has ever become poor by giving so go ahead donate to charities help kids and animals save the world be a good guy Number 10. Think of your legacy. Leaving a legacy is not only about your finances. It includes your values as well, or who you are as a person. It's also about how you want to be remembered. You want people to follow your footsteps. You become a leader. You want to inspire everyone and you have the power to influence others. So think far into the future. What can you create so people will remember you forever? So what is the first thing you would do when you get rich? Let us know in the comments. Here's an additional lesson today from Brian Tracy. A clear vision backed by definite plans gives you a tremendous feeling of confidence and personal power. So if you want to enter the Millionaire Club, Stop ignoring lessons, advice, feedback, or anything that can make you grow as a person. Thank you for making time to watch this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. We want to inspire you to work your way up to the Millionaire Club.